What is going on YouTube? This is The Last Musketeer and welcome to a Paradox mission for Swire. Now Swire is my favorite op, so of course I'm going to show her some love and for a lot of people they probably haven't seen this Paradox mission because a lot of people neglect Swire, which is sad to see, uh, but I'm going to go ahead and show you what it looks like. So I have her skills at rank 7, I have mastery 2 on the second skill which is what I'm going to use for this mission, but we're going to go ahead and get right into it guys. So you'll notice there is a healing pad here that I'm going to drop her on. Uh, that way I can kind of bait out if I need to, but you don't necessarily have to with the stuff you're going to get from what the snipers are going to take down. So you're going to have a lot of these crates that are dropping through. Uh, some really cool things with some of them being taken down and giving you a burst of attack speed, which makes it super fast for her clearing, as you see there, which is really, really fun to watch. But you're also going to build up a lot of these supplies. Now, the main thing is using this arch damage one uh, to link the electricity between the sides. Uh, because the main thing is, it's not only just going to do damage, it's also going to slow, which is very crucial to what you're going to be doing. Now, I think you might be able to get away with doing it without it if you can time the stuns correctly. But... If you want to make it really easy on yourself, you just go ahead and do this, and they're going to take a lot of damage by the time they get to Swire, and she's also going to be able to do a ton of damage herself while they're stuck in that field because she is not blocking. Now I'm going to drop uh, this little explosive for true damage, just so when it comes to the boss, I can go ahead and finish him off real quick. If I wanted to, I could also pop it early to get rid of some of the more tanky units because she can't do much to them, but the field that is doing all of the arts damage is making pretty good work of them, and I will have to drop a stun here just to keep them out of range, but as you can see, they're going down actually pretty quickly despite being as tanky as they are, so I go ahead and throw a stun, they're all stuck there for multiple seconds, it just, it, this is basically the easiest Paradox mission that I've ever done, but it is enjoyable to watch. I, I very much enjoy this one, and for some reason I drop a stun here, just because I wasn't paying attention, I guess. Uh, so he is out of her range, and he's just sitting there taking slower damage, so uh, once he walks into her path this time, I have the skill active, I have the attack increase, the attack speed increase, so she's doing a ton of damage, and I go ahead and pop the true damage just to finish him off, and that is it. That is all there is to this Paradox mission, but I did enjoy it, I did love it, and of course it being Swire, I had to show it off, just in case people hadn't seen it before. But anyway, that's going to do it for me, guys. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.